It's coming home. It's coming home. Football's coming home. It's coming home. It's coming home. It's coming. Football's coming home. It's coming home. It's coming home. It's coming. Football's coming home. It's coming home. It's coming home. It's coming. Football's coming home. It's coming. Everyone seems to know the score. They see. How's it going folks? This is Wayne Orr back for another lesson and just why at this point England is still in the World Cup I thought I'd do a nice topical one today, uh, Three Lions. I actually did this one a couple of years ago, I've had loads of requests so I thought I'd do sort of an updated version, a higher quality version, um, obviously we can have some close ups as well of what we're actually doing. There is a couple of bar chords in this song so it's not a sort of a beginner's song but I always say you know it's a great one if beginners try and learn bar chords you know and maybe take a song on like this that contains a couple of bar chords but um, it's a great fun one to play and you know while England are still in at this point I think it's going to be great to play in pubs or, or around your house or whatever so without further ado let's get to it. Okay so the song is in standard tuning but you're going to want the capo on the first fret okay and the opening chords are just going to be a G chord going to a D major chord okay so it's going to go it's coming home it's coming football's coming home it's coming home it's coming home it's coming football's coming home it's coming okay and this is where the song sort of gets a little bit busy I'll go over the strumming pattern in a short while well basically the chords that you're going to need now for this part which is also the chorus is a G we're going to do a D over an F sharp, which basically, the best way to do this that I tend to do it now is I'll do a D chord, I'll use my thumb to grab that second fret on the E string, valve to the capo to get that F sharp note in there. Okay, then we're going to go to an E minor, an A major, a D, an F sharp minor, a B minor, and then an A chord. So that in, obviously with the song, so we've got the G, the D over the F sharp, E minor, A, D, F sharp minor, B minor, A. Okay, so that's gonna be, you know. It's coming home, it's coming. Bubbles coming home, it's coming home, it's coming home, it's coming, bubbles coming home, it's coming. Okay, so then we get into the verse, so that starts with an E minor, so everyone, we go to an A chord, seems to know that we go to a deep score, 
Okay, this time we want a B major bar chord, so sing it all around again. The chorus is the same as the part that we just did, so three words See what I did there? Stop me dreaming. Can you believe this song is is twenty-two years old? That is um, that is scary, unbelievable. And we still haven't won anything. Come on, England. What's up with you? Okay, so then we, we've got another verse, we've got another chorus part, uh, and then we've got this little middle part that goes in E minor, C, F sharp minor, we go to a B, B major, round again, C, F sharp minor, B, this time we got E minor, I know it was then. But it could be again. And we finish on the B major there, and then it comes back in with the G and the D, so it's coming home, it's coming, football's coming home, it's coming home, it's coming home, it's coming, football's coming home, it's coming. Let me go back in. It's coming home, it's coming. And to, you know, sort of finish it on an E minor. Okay, so the strumming pattern. Um, basically, the intro. So we're going to have a G chord. So down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up. And then the same on the D chord. So down, down, up, up, down, up. If you do struggle with strumming, I recently did a series on strumming. If you want to go and check that out, I think it's a six-part series on different strumming patterns that I tend to use in a lot of songs. This is a popular one that I use a lot, so if you want to look at that a bit more thoroughly, please go and check my strumming lessons out. So down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down, up, up, down, up. Okay, so these are the chords that go sort of a whole bar. The chords, when we get into like the chorus part or the next part, you know, they're... Okay, so these are sort of half bar chords. So what I tend to do on these, so like down, down, up, down, down, up on each chord. So we're down, down, up. So down, down, up, down, down, up, down, up, down, up, down. So then we go back into the down, down, up, up, down, down. Okay, so those two patterns will pretty much take you through the song, and that is pretty much it. Come on, England! Okay, so thanks very much for watching. Hope you all dug that. I thought I'd put my retro England shirt on for the outro. Um, probably the best shirt they ever did. And it was reversible, which, in my opinion, is an absolute bargain. Or when it's dirty, you just turn it inside out. So there you go. Um, thanks very much for watching, like I said. I've, I've actually had loads of requests to redo this song. I did it a couple of years ago for the Euros, but I thought I'd do sort of an updated slightly tweaked sort of version of this so we uh, hope you all enjoy this and it's a great one at this point why like england is still in the world cup as i always say to play at parties or pubs or you know if you're watching the england game at home with loads of beers it's great to get your guitar out and, and have a rendition of this song which in my opinion is probably one of the best england songs probably this one and world in motion that you know this one edges it to me i absolutely love this song 
So uh, hope you will love that. Uh, thanks everyone who requested it. If you've got any requests for any other songs, e even if they are topical like this one, please either comment in the post below or a good way to reach me. If you like my page on Facebook, which is Wayne R Guitar, uh, you can send me a personal message. I'm also on the same name on Twitter if you want to give me a follow. But uh, and thanks everyone who subscribed. If you haven't, if you are new to me, please do. I've got coming up to 400 lessons now and great sort of acoustic songs. I do do a lot of topical ones like this. I'm a big Manchester music fan, so there's loads of Oasis, the Stone Roses, the Smiths, all the great bands in my opinion. So uh, please hit that subscribe button. And I'll catch you all for a lesson very soon. Take care.